Good morning guys, I'm Shivalia. How are you all doing? It's around 8.30 in the morning and um, yesterday was my meal prep day but I did not meal prep because I was out of bananas. Uh, I needed around 12 bananas for meal prep and I only had 4 so obviously I have to cook breakfast in the morning. So for breakfast I'm just having pancakes with almond flour, eggs and some bananas. So I've got some ground up almonds with salt and baking powder that's exactly 25 grams and I'll be adding 2 eggs. Uh, three small bananas that will be around 100 to 120 grams and I'll just make pancakes out of them. Always use ripe bananas for your pancakes because um, you will not need to add any sugar and also ripe bananas as far as I've read won't constipate you. I also added cinnamon and vanilla in this because um, cinnamon and bananas go really well and cinnamon is also anti-inflammatory and I also get like um, one teaspoon of butter I'm allowed one teaspoon of butter in the morning so this I've measured it out already this is my roti maker where I make pancakes, dosa, uttupam and all those stuff but uh, I couldn't really make rotis in this they did not fluff it was too thick you know so uh, yeah so either I don't know how to make this roti maker properly work because I ain't got no rotis with it, nada, zero. Or this just doesn't work. Like uh, if any of you use a roti maker, um, please tell me how this works because I haven't been able to get a single good roti out. And I will make two of these because... I really don't want to continue like cooking small ones and just you know that's more time consuming so I make two large ones it's easier and quicker sorted the small piece of bell pepper and like one floret of broccoli because I cooked breakfast for my husband in the morning and this was left over from his breakfast and I don't want to waste any oops I don't want to waste any food so this is breakfast guys it's around 460 to 470 calories and these pancakes I tell you these pancakes although they are a little burnt they are so good. Mm, the vanilla, the cinnamon, the butter. You guys should try this out. So I'll just go have breakfast um, and actually check out my YouTube subscription. Hey guys, so it's almost lunch time and I'm done with my shower, the cooking for the day, the cleaning, everything. I just like to get over with all the chores by lunch so that after lunch I just have free time for myself because I don't want to, you know, just um, focus my entire life around cooking and uh, focus my entire day maybe, focus my entire day around cooking and the chores. Um, so during this time I made my lunch, I only have the fish to prep now. I cook lunch uh, for dinner for my husband, lunch he has at his work and I'm sorry if I'm sweating a lot, it's just very very hot in the kitchen okay, it's just the temperature is just going up so fast out here. So anyways, I'll show you what I made, uh, I'm sorry if I'm sweating again, I'm just very sweaty, it's just and I have my hair open as well you know because I just had a shower okay. I made these um, energy balls which is just a fancy name for healthy laddus and they are basically just three ingredient laddus it's just uh, coconut, dates and almonds and a little bit of spices um, so I made these these are rotis, these are gluten free these are made of uh, bajre kata which is pearl millet flour it also has a little bit of basin that is chickpea flour and there is a lot of fenugreek leaves that is methi so I made these for my husband for dinner and I also have um, palak paneer which I'll serve these with so everything is done and I just have to prep my fish now so my fish uh, is already prepped I have just marinated this in lime juice and some spices and this is basa basa is a kind of a catfish but it is a smaller um, catfish not the huge one which I normally have 
So I'm allowed one teaspoon of oil, which I'll put here. You really don't need uh, much oil when doing these kinds of fatty fish like catfish because it has its own oil, you know. You just want to just uh, get the searing process going on. Guys, lunch is served. Uh, so what I'm having is pan fried fish and I also have a small um, salad, you may call it onion, tomato, coriander, lime juice uh, ensemble here. And what I have for my side is palak paneer. This is actually 50 grams of uh, paneer with 70 grams of palak. So I've got my fat in the paneer and in the fish, I've got my carbs in the vegetables and the spinach and um, I've got my protein in the paneer as well as the fish. And this may not really look like much, but this is actually 500 and um, around 60, I think. This is around 560 calories, okay? So I'm heading out to my mom's now and um, I will also, we, we will go together shopping because I need to buy eggs and bananas and uh, vegetables and I'll be back to show you uh, my workout and then dinner, okay? Bye. Hey guys, I'm back and it's uh, 6.15 already, so... Uh, a lot of time has passed and why am I carrying this backpack? Uh, I got a lot of uh, vegetables and stuff like that. But first thing is I need to take off my shoes and wash my hands because I just fed the dogs. Uh, not my dogs, I mean there are these two street dogs that live um, just behind our apartment. And um, I feed them daily, like in the evening once. So uh, let me just wash my hands and come. So I just want to show you real quick um, what I got. I got eggs. And I buy like 15 in one uh, go. Then I got uh, bananas because as I told you, I'm out of bananas and I got to meal prep for tomorrow. So I need to make my banana bread. So I got my bananas. And uh, over here, sorry, let's change. Um, I have uh, cucumbers, tomatoes and chilies for my salad. And I also picked up some uh, staples like very staplish uh, vegetables. So um, I'm just going to show it from here because take I'll just take it out directly in the fridge. So I got um, coriander because I love coriander and there are some peas, um, potatoes, onions. Um, I also have a, um, I don't know what you guys call this, but um, this is, I believe like, uh, small pumpkin or acorn do you call it an acorn squash i don't know but but i like it and then i also have a lot of uh, limes because i season everything with lime and uh, i also have um, cauliflower um, what i did not get is broccoli because they just did not have any broccoli today and i also have um, some ginger and fresh garlic the usuals. So yeah, that's what I got. My workout today is um, body weight training. So I have no uh, actual external weights. I mean, I will just be using my body weight for resistance. Um, I have body weight and I'll be finishing up with cardio. And this workout is, uh, I use the Freeletics app. So using that. And for my pre-workout today, remember those energy balls, laddus I made? I'll be having one laddu and one coconut water, tender coconut water for hydration.
workout is um, done um, and I'm very sweaty it's just so hot <sighs> I think I'll go take a shower now um, then I'll just prepare my banana bread for tomorrow and you know just keep all the vegetables that I have brought in their places and um, I'll be back at dinner time to show you what I ate and also to sum up the entire um, day's calories so guys this is dinner I have one serving this is 100 grams of broccoli sauteed in about 15 grams of olive oil uh, that is uh, roughly about one tablespoon and uh, for protein today I have uh, chicken breast and this is uh, in broth uh, I just saved the bones to make the broth in fact I have not even removed all the bones and uh, this is around 120 grams of chicken breast meat and I know like this might not look like a lot but this also is packed with calories and you guys know that at night I get dessert and I have something so special for dessert today I have Ta -da -da! this is a um, carrot cheesecake mousse let me just zoom in so that you can see this better yeah so this is a oh, focus you stupid camera this is my um, carrot cheesecake and cinnamon mousse and I made these yesterday they are ch they were chilling in the fridge like all night yesterday and today the entire day and for the next four days this will be my dessert so guys that is my dinner now let me just uh, take you through the entire day's calories and I have rounded off the digits for ease of calculation so breakfast was 470 calories lunch was 570 calories um, the pre-workout snack along with the coconut water was 170 calories and dinner is around 520 so I am at um, 1730 calories today yeah so I am within my target of 1800 and uh, Roundabout that will be around 1800 at the end of the day because I did not count the little salad tomato and onion salad and the seasonings and also that will be around 18 to 1820 that was my day today guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you have any questions then please leave it in the comment section below and uh, I'll be more than happy to answer to you guys and until my next video stay healthy bye bye take care bye good night